thousand miles have I walked many a time to find the stones. Over and over have I worked. This five sculptures cicadas is five stages of life, witnessed clearly by all. Lu Wan's sculptures are small miracles. He animates the raw stone, transforming the veins of color hidden within into exquisitely rendered animals. This is chameleon very special. I love this. Lu Wan works from life. His subjects can be as commonplace as garden snails, but more often than not, they are exotic species, like this emperor scorpion from West Africa. An accomplished painter, poet, and sculptor, Lu Wan attended China's finest art academies. As a young man, he so impressed government officials that he was brought to the Forbidden City, where he lived and worked for 16 years. Each one of his paintings and carvings are accompanied by a poem, written in traditional style. The poems are inscribed into the surface of his sculptures. Of these snails, streaked with cinnabar, he writes, I envy not a tall mansion, though in a small hut I am well content. This is a snail like this. Yeah. Mm. This is a poison frog. This is a poison frog. A poison frog. Yeah, this is a poem he wrote. And uh, yeah. This is the poem like a poison dart frog, right? Why do I still like to make friends with you, although you have a poison? Your poison is not on the surface of skin and not in the heart. <laughs> right, he covered that. Okay. Huh? Poison, the color beautiful. Yeah. Mm. Where is your poem you covered? Yeah, right. At the invitation of an American museum, Lu Wan and his wife, Lu An, first came to the United States in 1989 and then decided to stay here. A celebrated artist in China, Lu Wan has struggled to find his way in America. He and his wife live simply, and he spends his days much as he did in the Forbidden City, hard at work. Over his 16 years here, he has carved dozens of sculptures. Almost all of them still sit in a corner of his workroom, unsold and unseen, except for the occasional museum exhibit. 
He has a cherished wish. He、mm-hmm. hope、uh, this work could be kept in a suitable museum. He hope、uh, in the future all of the small animals can find the right home. He said, no matter how he loved them,、yeah. but he cannot keep them forever.